Hi, this is Andrea Shulman again, and in today's quick law of attraction video, I'm going to talk about the path of least resistance and action, because I get a lot of questions about the path of least resistance and how does action figure into the equation when we talk about the law of attraction. But first, if you're watching this video on YouTube or on my website, please make sure to subscribe because I do put out new law of attraction videos, just like this one, every single week. Also, if you're watching this video specifically on YouTube, be sure to tap the bell and turn on your notifications so that you are notified whenever I release a new video. So let's go ahead and talk now about the path of least resistance and how action fits into the equation. All right, so the term, the path of least resistance, is a term that is commonly used in the law of attraction community. And the idea is that when you are hoping to manifest something, it always works best to take the path that has the least amount of struggle in it, the least amount of fight in it, the least amount of resistance in it. And so this is, it's actually very good advice to take the path of least resistance. But sometimes what happens is that when people hear the term, the, past, the path of least resistance, what they interpret it to mean is the path of least activity or the path of least action. Okay, and that's actually not what it means. The path of least resistance doesn't mean that the way to all your dreams is just to lay on the couch and eat Cheetos all day and for the thing that you want to drop in your lap. Now, that might be the path of least resistance, but it also might not be the path of least resistance because sometimes the path of least resistance does contain action. It does contain you being actively involved. And so this is an important thing to understand about the path of least resistance is that whether or not there's action has nothing to do with the resistance. Really, it's not about the action or about the movement or about the what you're doing. It's more about the how you feel inside that's important. That's the resistance that we're talking about. The, the path of least resistance is the path that feels the easiest for you psychologically to take. Okay, so let me give you an example. Let's say that something that you would really love to manifest in your life is to complete a full marathon. You want to run an entire marathon. That is an experience that you want to manifest into your life. Well, you could sit on your couch and eat Cheetos, okay? But if you were just sitting on your couch eating Cheetos day in, day out, knowing that the marathon was coming up in a few months, how would you feel the closer you got to that go time? You're probably gonna start feeling more and more stressed, more and more anxious, because sitting on the couch just eating Cheetos doesn't really feel like it's taking you to that marathon completion. Now, in this case, this is a pretty obvious one, but in this case, it would probably make more sense to take some action. So it would probably feel better psychologically that you knew you were gonna start, you were gonna run this race in a few months, so that you start running or you start doing some exercise. But again, you're taking action, but it's the path of least resistance. So you're taking the amount of exercise, you're doing the amount of running that your body can handle, and you're kind of building up and letting the momentum get you there, okay? Now, the other way to go about it is the way that people often inter interpret it, which is that people take too much action, and, and that can absolutely happen too. So again, let's say that the same goal is there. You wanna manifest a completion from, for a marathon. You wanna run an entire marathon start to finish. Well, you could take another path that had action in, in it, but had way too much action. So you just get up today and the marathon isn't for a few months and you say, you know what, I'm gonna go out and run 26.2 miles today. Well, if you're not ready for it, it might be too much action. It might be too much strain on your body, okay? So the path of least resistance is not about not taking action. It's about knowing psychologically 
what do I feel best about doing as I move towards this goal and acting in alignment with that. Sometimes that means action. Sometimes it means sitting on the couch eating Cheetos, okay? But it d depends on what it is that you're trying to manifest, but really ask yourself, what feels like the most important thing for me to do right now? Is there action that I feel good about taking in this direction? Or does it feel like, you know, maybe I've been taking too much action and I should probably take a rest and go do something else. But whatever feels like it's the psychologically appropriate thing for you to be doing, that is your path of least resistance. So again, path of least resistance does not mean that we just sit in a room and things just fall in our lap. Ultimately, that really wouldn't be a lot of fun. It would get boring after a while if things that we wanted were just dropping into the room and there was nothing that we actually were out there doing because as human beings, we actually enjoy doing things. So doing is often a part of the path of least resistance. Thanks for watching today's quick video on the path of least resistance and action. If you enjoyed this video, you might also enjoy another one of my videos entitled How to Always Be Inspired in your action. And you may find that there's a link to that video in the description if you're interested in watching that now. Also, a quick reminder, I do have a very large database of longer Law of Attraction tutorials, like this one, but much more in depth and a lot more information to them. And if you're interested in checking that out, again, there may also be another link down there with information on that, or you can just check it out on my website at raiseyourvibrationtoday.com. Thanks again for watching today's video and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.